So let's take a look at the internals of the MSI GT75 Titan. Uh, to remove the bottom panel, you want to remove the five screws located in the corners and one in the middle, then just simply lift this off, pops right up. As you can see, you got dual exhaust fans with the uh, whirlwind blades, which improves airflow at the same RPM of any other conventional fan. You got nine heat pipes. This is your GTX 1080. This is the uh, 70, uh, 8950 HK processor. Here's your two RAM module, modules and your wireless card. It's the battery and MSI has done a very neat thing here. You see under this heat sink are the three M.2 SSDs that I have, the, the 960 Pros. And what this does, it helps keep the temperature of the SSDs down so you won't get any thermal throttling because they do get hot. And underneath it is the 2.5 inch space. So you got three M.2 slots here, all NVMe uh, and your 2.5 inch. Now, my only gripe with this laptop is the other two RAM uh, slots are located on the other side of the laptop underneath the keyboard. And in order for you to access those, you're gonna have to uh, dismantle the whole motherboard and the entire laptop, which is very, very difficult and time consuming. Same thing goes for the keyboard. If you wanna uh, service the keyboard or replace any of the keys, then you would have to dismantle the whole laptop. So what I recommend is when you're purchasing this laptop to make sure that you get the maximum RAM that you want from, from the get-go in order for you, for you to avoid this. Um, yeah, that's it for the internals. And then of course, this is your Dynaudio speakers here uh, and your Dynaudio subwoofer. Yeah, that's it for the interior.